Hi guys, it's Ashley, and it's some crazy hour, 3 a.m. or something like that, but I'm just up here in my bedroom with this little girl. She's my new baby. Her name is Haven, and she's the Ural Sculpt by Priscilla Lopez, or Lopes. I don't really know how to pronounce it. It's really funny because... Um, I have friends um, whose names are, last names are spelled exactly the same, but they're pronounced totally different. But anywho, um, here she is. I am just over the moon with her. I'm sorry, the lighting isn't that good. Like I said, it's probably 3 a.m. And um, I've just been posing her and admiring her. I'm just so over the moon. Over the moon. Sorry if you hear some scratching in the background. It's one of my cats. But I just wanted to come on and share a few moments with you guys. I was going to um, feed her with um, a modified bottle that I had bought off eBay. But I went to pick it up and it exploded everywhere. All over my bed, all over her, all over myself. Oh, and it smelled like rotten garlic. I don't know. I bought it off eBay and it already had the liquid in it. And it was already had the glue and everything to modify it. So I have no idea what this mystery substance was, but I had to change my bed sheets, my bedspread, the clothes I were I was in. <laughs> it's, it's awful. Um, so I won't be feeding her, but I did change her out of her cloth diaper. I did have. Um, let me see. This is the cloth diaper I had her in, and it. Um, it's extremely similar to the brand Little Joey, but Little Joey's are like $20 each. This one is um, the brand, does it say Happy, let me see, Happy Flute. Yeah, the brand is Happy Flute, and you can get these diapers um, off eBay for almost $8, and there, I compared them to the little joey brand is exactly the same exactly the same maybe the material is slightly different but the size is the same um, they look the same inside and these fit um preemie to newborn so they're perfect for uh these little babies but i just i changed her out of that um i put her in a regular diaper get her over here <laughs> come here <laughs> your little chicken eggs um, for those of you who are familiar with the Ashley Realborn um, this baby is similar um, similar in size to the Ashley Realborn she has really thin thin petite limbs super cute her painting is beautiful. It's really beautiful. Super realistic. She's got blushing on the palms of her hands. Little tons of color. Very rich. Very cute. <laughs> Very cute in her little feet. See the blushing along her feet. Her artist did a great job. Great, great job. <laughs> she has that expression on her face like, I have gas. Because <laughs> babies this little don't typically smile for enjoyment purposes. <laughs> they usually, you know gas bubbles or you know <laughs> maybe they're dreaming but she's just super cute <coughs> excuse me 
And I also, um, I saw those of you who are, who are OG, <laughs> um, Baby Love Heart Smith followers, you will remember my Levi sculpt that I had. His name was Owen, and he was Reborn's, hello, <laughs> can I help you? What do you, oh. See that pile? <laughs> that pile over there is all of the stuff that that milk exploded on. <laughs> so I have a lot of laundry to do tomorrow. Um, anyways, back to uh, what I was talking about for Owen. Um, he was my Levi sculpt. I sold him a few months back, but the opportunity to re-adopt him came up, and so I did. I re-adopted him. So... Owen and I will be reunited sometime next week, and I'm really excited about that. Um, I've missed him, and I regretted selling him. I thought I was ready to let him go. He was my true therapy doll. He got me through some really hard times last year, and I thought that I was ready to let him go and to move on, but the energy around that doll, you know, he's meant to come back. So he's going to be coming back, which is really exciting. <laughs> he's, he's so pretty. Oh, I could just look at her for, for days. She's just gorgeous. Her hair is beautiful. I really love the hair on the sides here. <laughs> I can't wait to see what she looks like in the morning light. I have her up here in my bedroom and I have this really big um, window over here with the arch on top. I think in the morning when the morning light comes in she's going to look so beautiful. So I can't wait for that. I'll probably be up for the sunrise, so. Well, we'll probably say so long for now. I just wanted to pop in. I hope everyone's having a good night. And I'll talk to y'all later. Bye, guys.